Hi Sagittarius. So of course I owe you guys a bonus read. You guys have been kicking up for me. And I just want to graciously thank you. So, so to show my appreciation. Sorry I am tongue tied. I'm tired. I am going to be giving you guys a bonus read tonight. Okay. So thank you guys for tuning into my channel. Please keep in mind that my readings are general and may or may not resonate. So take with us and leave the rest. Also, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And if you would like to book a personal with me, please do so. I am going to leave my information in the comment section. Feel free to email me, okay? First card out. Love yourself first. It says your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive, okay? It is safe for you to love. It says, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Okay. And heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss, discuss your feelings. Bottom of the deck, healing family issues. So, okay. I feel like you need to have that talk with your kids or your parents. A lot of us are parents, so if you you're a parent, then there's then you need to spend time with your kids. Your kids are needing to have a word with you, ma'am. <laughs> Get them kids from about the attic, okay? <laughs> Take them outside. They want to go. They want to go outside too. <laughs> Anyways, okay. Let's see what's going on with my Sagittarius. Fred, please give me some energy for my Sagittarius, please. So, I see somebody wanting to reconcile with you. Hmm. Yeah, after ending, there was something that happened here. But this person, let's see. Why is this? Let's see. Yep, you make this person happy, so they want to come back to you. However, there's a lot of conflict with this offer here. But this person is definitely trying to come back. Look, passionate, so they love you. Okay, let's see. Why is a judgment card here? Three of Swords. I feel like this person might have broken your heart. But with the High Priestess, you knew this person was going to come back. Yeah, because they, you know that they, this is where their happiness is too. So you know that you make this person happy. And here they come to offer you a new start however this person has a problem with playing mind games with people i feel like this is how they win yeah this is how this person wins this person um is is just really uh not petty but this person is a bitch or an asshole a bastard yeah they like to keep you confused this is good for you this is how they win I feel like with Eight of Cups, this person is coming back after they already walked away from you. And now they want something solid. Now they're ready for a relationship. They're ready to do everything that they didn't do before. But again, there's too much conflict here. Why is there so much conflict? Because this person is toxic. They come in, they give you all this love, they love bomb you, and then back out. This person is an attention whore. They love coming to you for attention when they're down. Because you balance them off. You are a healer. You are this person's healer. You're like a fucking mom or a dad to this person. Yeah, justice. You give this person the feels. You make them feel good. You make them feel better about themselves. They, You might get messages from this person. This person might just message you out the blue. Like, this is not even somebody that you're always in contact with, but they just pop back up in your world. That's because they you, you make them feel good about themselves. All right, spirit, tell me more. Tell me more about how this person feels. Spirit, tell me more. Please, Spirit, tell me more. Ten of Swords. Knight of Swords. Ace of Cups. So I feel like this person is constantly thinking about this ending that they had with you. They didn't want it. This person wants justice. It def you definitely could be dealing with a... Uh, a Libra here yeah they didn't want this ending this person is heartbroken about this ending they thought they had you 
Seven of Pentacles with the Five of Pentacles. They want to put the work in, but you done left this motherfucker out in the cold. And maybe rightfully so. Yeah, they want to message you. I feel like you might have told this person in messages that you were leaving them. You were being pretty fucking bitchy when you did it, too. But with the Six of Pentacles, it was because this person was not giving enough to you. And who the fuck wants to, who wants to be breadcrumbed? Okay. So, let's get the outcome. Please give me the outcome. The outcome for my Sagittarius, please. I see you winding up in a relationship. <laughs> There's a relationship coming in. Yeah, this person who likes running in and out of your life, they're coming back to heal this with you. This person wants your ass. Yeah, I feel like you'll be rushing it. Ooh, there's going to be a lot of sex involved. Mm-hmm. After this little ghosting situation, after this person gets time to think they're gonna be rushing to give you the the wand, okay? Might be a nice size wand too. Or they or oh god, see out here I am thinking nasty. Anyways, you'll be happy. Okay. Let's get some advice from spirit now. Okay, spirit. Please give me some advice. Advice for my Sagittarius moving forward. Four of Cups. If it's not exactly what the fuck you want, how you want it, don't take it. Do you understand me? Stay guarded until somebody comes in that's supposed to be here. Because nobody's supposed to be here. Stay away from third party relationships. Make sure that motherfucker is choosing you. And if not, ghost them. Let them go. I feel like some communication is coming in. Be on the lookout for that. What is this communication going to be about, spirit? What is this communication going to be about, spirit? I'm nosy, y'all. I'm sorry. What is this communication going to be about? You leaving them out in the cold. Them wanting to still be happy with you. Them loving you. Falling in love with you. Not knowing what to do. Huh. Yeah. Them being at a crossroads. Not knowing what to do. Wanting to really choose you person really wants you they they're and the, <laughs> this person was waiting to apologize again look reconciliation at the bottom of the deck because they want you back all right let's get a card from the rebel deck and i'm going to release you guys okay all right spirit give me one card from the rebel deck one card from the rebel deck please one card from the rebel deck one card from the rebel deck thank you it says take a shot. All right, y'all need drinks. Now, you know Sagittarius is never shy from fucking a drink or two. It says don't take 12. Take one, maybe two, and then move the fuck on. All right. Bye, you guys.